Sometimes you will want to share records with friends or family members. We make this easy with what we call shared folders. To create a shared folder, click the Create New button. Select Shared Folder and use the drop down arrow to choose whether or not you want to nest this folder within another folder. Otherwise, by default, it will appear under My Vault. Now name your shared folder and click Create. You will notice this process was exactly the same as creating a regular folder. But as you will see, shared folders contain some special options. Also, notice shared folders are differentiated from regular folders with a unique icon. The shared folder detail pane now appears on the right side of your screen. Click Edit to add records and users to the folder. As you can see, you can either search for and add existing records within your vault to the folder, or move records by dragging and dropping them into the folder at a later time. You can also use the permissions dropdown to adjust the permission level of each individual record you add. By default, the records are given read-only permissions. Next, click the Users tab to share the folder with other users. It is important to note that the person you are sharing the folder with must also have a Keeper account. If you'd like, you can invite friends and family to Keeper using the link below. Now, in the field that says Email or Team Name, enter an email address of someone you want to share this folder with, and click Add. That person will receive an email invite notifying them that you have shared a Keeper folder. They must accept the invite to complete the sharing process. Again, you can use the Permissions dropdown to adjust the permission level each user receives over the records and users within that folder. Remember, moving forward, any additional records you add to the shared folder will be shared with all of the users of that folder. When you are done, click Save.